Ladies and gentlemen, our student speakers. No matter where you're from, attending the George Washington University changes you. Perhaps the same could be said for any college, but I think it is undeniable that living in the nation's capital, we are faced with one-of-a-kind challenges every day that, whether we realize it or not, have contributed to who we are. Motorcades are no longer something to call home about, but rather an obstacle between you and the other side of Pennsylvania Avenue. We no longer giggle at the words foggy bottom. And although we may try time and time again, we will never actually know what is in Minutia's GW sauce. <laughs> the real challenge, though, has only just begun. Perhaps one day you'll be faced with a new kind of problem, like deciding whether to move away from family for a job, or if your major, what you've dedicated countless hours and too many sleepless nights to, is really what you want to do. It can get overwhelming when there are only a few knowns, would seem like a million unknowns, and Texas Instruments doesn't make a large enough calculator. <laughs> There's one thing I do know. I could not be more confident that the about-to-be GW graduate sitting in front of me today is ready. In every graduation speech I've seen in movies, this is the part where the speaker stands in front of the graduates and exclaims, we finally made it. But I disagree. I don't think we finally made it. I think we've just gotten here. This is when it all really starts. We are at a place in our lives which we will never be at again. So if you take nothing else from my speech today, other than that some engineers are half-decent writers, of course, <laughs> remember the regrets that really eat away at you are from the things you didn't do, not from the things you did. Always wondering what it would have felt like, tasted like, been like, those are the regrets that never go away. Trust that you have the skills to do whatever you want, because whether you believe it or not, I know you do. So class of 2009, I congratulate you and challenge you. In fact, I triple dog dare you to take those risks and live without regret. Now, as we each go our separate ways and exit the George Washington University bubble we have called home for so long, we must remember that today we are not each other's competition, but we are peers and most importantly, friends. So whether you studied engineering, international affairs, human services, business, journalism, or anything in between, from one friend to another, congratulations, good luck, enjoy life wherever it may take you. Thank you.